Now the majority of these transitions work simply by adding a transition on the in and out point between two shots. And for the most cases, you can do a direct cut like you see here on my timeline. But there might be some transitions where you want to overlap the second shot. So in this case, I'm just going to use uh, the springy transition. I'm going to drag number six onto the in point and to the out point. So if I play this, you're going to see that it moves in, it moves out. And that could be fine. You may want to have that type of effect for your edit, but you can also overlap the existing shot, shot number two, and you just want to scrub until you can see where the transition starting to happen. All right, now if I play this back, you're just going to get a smooth transition. And again, that is just using an overlap procedure. Thank you.